Okay, today we are in a Ford Explorer Police Interceptor. We'll be illustrating how to attach ProClip item number 213488 found at ProClipUSA.com. Uh, before we get started, we want to mention a couple things. First of all, read the instructions and look over the photos before you get started. Next is always attach the vehicle mount onto the vehicle first. Once you have the mount attached to the vehicle, then you can attach some things onto the vehicle mount. Uh, next is this particular ProClip vehicle mount comes with uh, some double-sided tape. You'll see them as the blue items here. Sometimes it is the uh, yellow uh, or red, but uh, you'll want to remove the tape covers off the tape uh, prior to attaching it to your vehicle. It'll help solidify it. The residue from the tape will not remain onto the dashboard if you ever want to remove it later on down the line. Uh, next is uh, all the ProClip vehicle mounts are designed with a certain amount of flex to them. That flex is put in there to keep the vehicle mounts tight on the vehicle. Next, uh, to get started, you'll take the ProClip vehicle mount in your hand, uh, and to make sure that the, the top side is up, there's a ProClipUSA.com sticker on it. The, uh, this is the top side, this is the bottom side. Both top and bottom sides have an angled edge. You'll see it here, that's what the back of the mount looks like. The bottom angled edge is here, the top angled edge is on top here. You'll take the lower angled edge of the ProClip vehicle mount and there's a display screen on the Ford uh, Explorer. The lower part of the angled uh, edge of the ProClip vehicle mount will go into a seam between the glass panel and uh, the frame surrounding the vent area. Place it in there and uh, apply some pressure upward so it goes into the seam. You might hear it click a little bit. Now with one hand, you'll be pressing backwards or back towards the windshield. In the other hand, you can press downwards. What you're trying to do is the angled edge on the top part of the Pro Clip will hook behind the frame that surrounds the vent. Uh, you may hear it click, you may not hear it click, sometimes it does. Uh, but once it's on there, there's the click we want to hear. Once it's on there, you'll have a nice solid platform to mount your items on.